Hey guys and happy Magic Monday. I've got a fun trick for you to do today um, that you can entertain your family with um, at the dinner table. So what you're going to do is you're going to take a fork and a spoon and you're going to stick the spoon into the fork tongs as far as you can. And it works to have the two inside tongs on the bowl of the spoon and the outside tongs on the outside of the spoon. You can push it all the way in there. Then you're going to take a toothpick and stick the toothpick right in between those center tongs. And you should be able to balance it. Whoops! It might take a few tries. You should be able to balance it on your finger. And what you want to do, try and do is find that center of gravity So once you find the center of gravity on your finger, then you can try placing the toothpick on a glass. And I found it works best if the glass has a slant to it, rather than going straight up and down. So you're going to take that toothpick and set it on the glass and find that center of gravity again. If you notice, the handles of the uh, fork and spoon are tilted downward. And that's making that possible for it to balance like that. So this is cool in itself, but if you want to get really fancy and you have adult supervision, of course, you can try lighting a match. And I'm going to light this stick on either end. I'm going to light it at this end, and I'm going to light it at that end. Remember, this is only with uh, adult supervision. So we know that fire needs three things. It needs oxygen, fuel and heat to burn. When the fire reaches the fork and the glass, it runs out of heat and it stops burning. Check it out. Is that cool or what? So that spoon and fork are balancing on the very edge of that glass because of center of gravity. Give it a try. Have fun.